from drugs, deliverance from drugs. So that they may run out and glorify you in this good help. What, what needs do you have? Who wants to pray? You've already prayed? Okay. Did you get one of these? We're giving away a free prayer today. What, what prayer needs do you have? We're seeing miracles. We're seeing healings. We're Who seeing. Who do you pray to, though? Uh, Jesus. Who do you pray to? Well, see, we, we agree. He to you is who? Who is he to you? Christ. He's your... Savior and God. That's what we're praying for. Good. Um, and we're seeing miracles, we're seeing healings, we're seeing deliverances, we're seeing all kinds of really cool stuff. And as long as he's moving, our feet move. Well, then pray for my wife to be healed. She has just back problems. Okay. Right on that. Um, we're going to pray for that in, in a moment. Um, it's... Uh, but I do want my wife to come too because it's your wife and that's my wife. Okay. So I, I do want her to pray with us. And that's kind of corny and kooky, but that's just what I feel in my spirit. So uh, his wife has back problems. Okay. And we're going to pray that for healing. What happened to her back? Do, um, do you know even? Well, yes, when she was a kid, well, a teenager, she just pulled a table and something happened to her back. And as she's getting older, she's getting worse. So she's had it for a very long time. Do you guys attend a church currently? I'm uh, sure we do. Okay. We're four square. None of you are a four square. No. Mm -mm. It's like Assemblies of God. We are AG. Yeah, so it's the same uh, belief, different church government. That's it. That's fine. Well, it's all politics anyway. Exactly. It's all about God anyway. It goes right to um, God. But I have to believe that her back is holding her back from God's purpose for her. Because it can't be easy to have a back pain and still do God's will. So we're going to pray that God's will is done so she can fulfill... I know she's fulfilling, but really fulfill right, right. God's plan and purpose in her life, okay? Cool. And I'm going to put my hands on you, do you mind? Yeah, you're in her standing place. in the gap. And we're yeah, gonna, I'm going to put my hand on your back in her place, do you mind? Okay. What's your name? Martin. And what's her name? Alexandra. Alexandra. Okay, we're, okay. we're going to pray for your wife. Hallelujah. Father God, thank you for your cross and your blood. The blood you said at Calvary is all forgiving, all cleansing, all healing, all purifying, Father. And I proclaim your name as my God and my King, our God, our King. You heal, you save, you deliver, you free from bondage, Father. You free us from ourselves, Lord. And I pray healing over his, this man's wife's life, Alexandra. I pray healing, Father. May your healing power, your Holy Spirit power, cover her right now, Father, where she sits, where she stands, as she feels your presence and your warmth and love over her life, Father. Free her from this, this pain, Lord, that, that minimizes her mobility and her ability to, yes, to proclaim Father. your name and move in your name, Father. She does the best she can to, yes, to service Father. you, but I have to believe in my heart that she's hindered by this. And we want nothing to hinder you and to hinder your gospel and truth. And I want you to be glorified, to be you exalted, to have you magnified above, above all names, oh, Father. Yes, Jesus, May Father. you be exalted, Father. May she run up and down the aisles of church tomorrow, Sunday, proclaiming your name and saying, I was healed, I was Amen. touched. My God delivered, my God saved and touched and redeemed and purified my body, Father. And I speak healing over this man and this wife, Father. Intensify their marriage. I know he loves her. I know she loves him. But intensify their marriage for one another. Increase their faith in you. Prosper yes, them in you as your will be done, Father. May they know you in more intimate and more deep ways, Father. May they live your life and live your truth. Proclaim your name and say that my God is my God who heals and saves and frees and delivers. And may you be exalted. May you be magnified. May you be glorified. And we pray for all... Hang on a second. This just came to me, Lord. Oh, yeah. Father, we know that we're, we're, your name arrives in the scene, that your blood delivers, oh, yeah. that your blood packs a powerful punch, Lord, that when you say it, you mean it. In the Bible, you say, what must be done to see your hand move? Yes, what must be done to see your miracles done? And it's very, very simple and very, very plain oh, yeah. to proclaim your name and know that you are our God, our Savior and King. And we know that you deliver, Father, and your blood is more powerful than the sickness. Where Satan assaults, your blood frees. Yes, and I know your blood can save and touch and heal and fix. And I proclaim in your name a healing touch right now Amen. that you will free and set free. And I feel a warmth in your back. Amen. I ask for a healing, Father. You touch her body right now. Yes, set her free from this pain. Hallelujah. Set her free from this bondage, Father. Yes, where Satan is assaulted and meant for bad, you turn her around and mean it for good. Yes, and I believe in my heart, Lord, that you will touch this dear lady of God 
and make her powerful in your name yes, so she can exalt your name through the streets and so people can come to know you. It may, may be salvation out of this pain that others might know you out of this pain, Father. I proclaim you in your name above all these things, material, financial, physical. Mm -hmm. You're above all because you are our all, Father. Amen. We praise you for all these things in your mighty name. Amen. Amen.